Good morning guys, welcome back to the vlog and we're officially starting Christmas Diaries. The Christmas mugs are out and today we're gonna decorate the house. I am so, so excited. I've been looking forward for Christmas videos literally for the last three months. I've been just so looking forward to this and it's here. So we have a lot of plans for this vlog. Of course, the first and most important one of them all is that today the tree is going up and we're gonna decorate the apartment. All the fall decoration has been stored and put away and we're just so ready. I want to go look today for new Christmas decorations and also go look for some gifts because I have one that probably I'm gonna wrap up today and put under the tree now that we're gonna have it up. But I do need to do a lot of shopping. I need to find Polo's gift. I need to find Polo's dad's gift. I need to find Geraldine, she's my sister-in-law. So today we're probably hitting all the stores and also all the Christmas decor stores. I gonna go to El Corte Inglés to see if we can see anything cute and you know also have some fun so I did receive a package yesterday that I just wanted to unbox I was a little bit hesitant if I wanted to put it under the tree but this is not supposed to be a Christmas gift this was just a very lucky lucky find and I basically jumped on it so this one I found at BAM luxury store I know that you guys already kind of know them I shop from them quite often but when I saw this in a specific color I just kind of had to. So they did give me a thank you note. BAM Luxury Store is actually located here in Barcelona. I've bought a few bags from them and I'm very familiar with their stocks. So they're basically having Christmas drop mass and every single day of December, they're basically dropping one new item. This is from December 1st to the 23rd at 6 p.m. Paris time. So I definitely would recommend you to follow them on Instagram. So when they announce their new arrivals, you're the first person if you're interested in the item because things fly by on their website. So when I open this one, it's all gonna definitely make sense. They have a whole range of different items from Hermes bags to Chanel to Louis Vuitton in amazing, amazing vintage pieces. And they also ship international, but thankfully I have them really, really close by so I can sometimes just drop and see what's in stock. So let's open this one up. It came full set, which is amazing. So this is the type of purchase that I already know that it's gonna work out because I kind of have one that I love and this one is just better than the one that I have. So, first of all, this is not only a wallet, it is also a micro bag. And this is the Hermes release wallet in the color Beton, just like my new bag. So literally they match, but this one is not in Togo leather. The leather looks like it's ever color and it's in gold hardware. So I did bring the bag. I'm gonna show you in different light, but this is my new favorite thing ever and now the fact that I found it in the same color and I just love 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 white and this is like grayish so basically like a gray beige and I also already have the strap to make it a bag so you open it up like this and let me take this off something that I love about this wallet is that it's not just a wallet it's also a mini bag and it has a little pouch here and usually here I can put hair ties coins anything that I don't want like roaming around the wallet and it does have one pocket here and one pocket on the back this strap I got it from Etsy and it's in Claire but it does match perfect and just like that, it's just a crossbody bag. It can also be a belt bag. In my opinion, this is the best wallet out there and it was such a good price that I could not pass on it. So yeah, I am beyond excited. I also really, really love the release because it doesn't have the big H that the Constant Slim does have. And still, I adore my Constant Slim and I use it so, so much. But this one for me is just perfect. This is literally everything that I ever wanted in a wallet because it's very versatile and sometimes I just want to go out with just the wallet and I can cross this one. Absolutely no problem but I also love the colors and the details that it has. So in case anyone wants to check out BAM Luxury Store, I'm gonna ask them if they have any Christmas or specific discount code to use for the holidays. I think they're a fantastic option to look for some Christmas presents or just like me getting something for yourself. So I'm gonna leave their website on the description box down below and also the discount code if they give me one. I'm definitely gonna show you the color comparison under the sun because the thing with Hermes colors is that depends on the leather, the color can look completely different even if it's the same. And I can definitely tell the difference with this and with the Birkin because it's in Togo. So this is definitely going to be the bag of the day and the wallet of the day too. So I'll show you how they look outside. So we want to start the season with some some pancakes and then we're gonna put the tree up. Let's go get some pancakes.
So we're done with breakfast and we're gonna start decorating the living room. I think what we're gonna do, same as last year, Masha's bed, we're gonna make her like a little nook right here. And this lamp that is actually new, we're gonna put it on this side and just basically start with the tree and then just decorate the rest. Seems like today it's going to rain pretty much all day or at least during the morning, so it's a bit gloomy. So we're just gonna play some Christmas music and play Home Alone on the TV in the background. Okay, so we're done decorating the living room and basically this is all the decor that we have so that is why today i wanted to go out and see if there's anything that catches our eye at the recording list it does seem like it stopped raining so i think we're good to go out so i'm gonna change but definitely the house feels way cozier and i'm just happy that the decoration is up i still want to work on decorating a little bit the office our bedroom and like the entrance of the house it all really depends if we see something that we like today or or if I wait and order something online. So yeah, let's go pick outfit of the day. Okay, so today it's going to be knee high boots outfit. So right now I'm wearing my indoor Uggs, but I was thinking to wear the Hermes jumping boots with a long coat and the baton Birkin. So this is going to be the coat and it's from Fabric. Because I'm gonna wear knee high boots, I'm gonna wear shorts and this on top. Thankfully, it doesn't really get that that cold here, so I can definitely get away with that outfit. So this is the base. It's just a pair of block shorts. They are a little bit flowy and I'm not sure if I want to use 
a long sleeve thermal black shirt or if this is fine I do have a black sweater but the whole thing is about this coat that I just really really love the way that it looks and that in my opinion really does make the outfit a little bit more put together I'm just traveling a little bit with the light for filming because it's so so cloudy that sometimes it looks like it's about to be nighttime but no so this is a coat. What I am kind of debating on is if I also want to wear a sweater underneath or if I should just bring it because I know that if I go indoors this might be a little bit too much but I really like how this kind of looks. And of course the bag of today. I think this is my first time selling the bag on a video and it's definitely not the best light to show you but this is the Birkin 25 in Baton rose gold hardware and I just got this one for my birthday and I know that it's not the best light but this is the two of them together so because the bag is not white white and it also has like a gray beige tone it's gonna look very well this is actually also like a gray beige and also the white socks kind of like pull it all together i'm still debating if i want the socks to show or not to show it kind of looks a little bit cleaner like this but i think i kind of like the little extra details that the sock offers so this is the outfit today we're gonna go to some stores to look for some christmas decor but we're also gonna go to look for some gifts so tomorrow i can wrap some things so i will probably also grab an umbrella in case it rains and let's go Okay, so we're gonna go to Paseo de Gracia first and we're gonna go to Miu Miu. I really wanna try and see if I can find a pair of boots that I've been very much in love with for a while. And I want Paula to try a few things. I don't know if we're gonna be able to film on every single store, but yeah, the first stop is going to be Paseo and all of those. And then we're gonna go to El Corte Inglés and to the Christmas store that it's in El Gotico. Go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand Okay, these ones are very, very cute Get all the Christmas songs that we love And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire all I want is to spend this day with you. Let me give you a Christmas. Oh my god, these ones are so beautiful. So toast, baby, with you. I don't need any presents as long as I spend this day with you. Tell me where 
Okay, so basically everything was a bit of a fail. We went to Isabel Melant and they did not have a single pair of shoes in my size to try. We went to a few stores to try things for polo, but I didn't really film that. But so far, nothing that really catches our eye. Also, for some reason, I swear that there was a Miu Miu in Barcelona. Like, I vividly remember seeing it and passing through it a couple of times, but I've never really gone inside. But it seems that it closed a while ago and now in its place, it's the new Zimmerman store a few times so I don't know I think I was just confused but I guess that I can check the boots on the website probably as for El Corte Inglés we usually go to El Corte Inglés um, that it's in diagonal that it's like the big one that has almost like a food court and everything that maybe we should do that for next vlog because right now we went to the one that it's in Plaza Catalunya and they didn't really have much to pick from so we came out empty-handed I'm gonna look online too they're probably gonna have some more options online and right now we're sitting down in El Gotico. I'm having some lemon tea and this is actually homemade and very very good. Paul is having a beer and the Christmas story is just literally like right around this corner so we finish this and we go. Okay, so we're back home and we're gonna put the chimney because it's quite cold. It's about to get really cozy here and also we're gonna have guests, so... We do need to stock up on more wood, so probably next week we're gonna order some. We did get something at the Christmas store. 
I'll show you in a second. We got it for the entrance because I feel like we literally only have decorated basically the living room and the rest of the house is very non-Christmassy. So I was looking for like bigger things to maybe fill some spaces. I was looking like a big Santa just to put on the little sofa that we have on the entrance or something like that. But I did not have a luck finding something cute. So I'll probably just gonna look online. But this one was very cute. It was not that crazy expensive. They did pack it very well. Not for you. We share, Masha. This is for both of us. But it's not a toy. It's hard. So I thought this one was very, very cute. It's a snowman. There were two options. One of them had like a Santa hat and this one has like a gentleman hat. And it was $29.95. Masha does want to take it, but this is not even a toy. If we bought the big plush toys, I would let you have them. So I'm gonna put this on the entrance and keep looking online. Probably tomorrow I'm just gonna sit down and browse some websites. I'm not gonna go crazy. I just want like a Christmassy blanket on the guest bedroom, maybe a cute pillow for our bed and just tiny things maybe in the office and the entrance. So I just need some time to sit down and check maybe even Sarah home. They sometimes have really nice plates. I would actually love to get some Christmas plates. I also went to Sephora and I just got things that I run out of. I got the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk blush. I think she just wants to get something. And I also got an eyebrow pencil from Fenty Beauty. So that's pretty much what we got today. I did want to go to Chanel, but the line was very, very long. And I wanted to get home in time to just relax a little bit and set everything up because we're gonna have friends um, just come. We will probably just order some takeout and maybe watch a movie. They're actually not gonna be here for Christmas. So we want to do like a Christmas before Christmas at some point. So that's the plan for the night. I'm gonna light some candles and just set everything up. I also ordered some things from Lush for the bathtub. So did I order some candy cane and Santa Claus bath bombs? Yes, I did. And I'm really, really excited to try them out. So I'm just gonna set everything up. Okay, so we're getting ready to go to bed and I'm gonna take a bath. I did grab a few candles and I ordered Christmas bath bombs from Lush. So this one actually smells like peppermint. It's a candy cane and it's a bubble bar. So this one is actually reusable. I also got this glittery gingerbread cookie. Um, this is not the one that we're gonna use today. This one is a polar bear. I really love the way that this one smells. And it also has like some glitter and pink dots. And this one is Santa Claus. And this is the one that we're gonna use today. It has some pink, yellow, corally, and white for the beard, of course. Feeling alone, kind of misty Wait 